Hi, my name's Simon Hater, and today we're going to be discussing how to get your Ubuntu uh, server to choose the nearest server to your location. So hopefully, in theory, you should receive quicker updates, quicker downloads, and so on. So the first thing you need to do is uh, log in via your favorite terminal uh, application. In this case, I'm using uh, Putty because I'm on Windows, but um, any terminal will do. So I've logged in, so the first thing you need to do is come out of your home directory. So we're going to do cd forward stroke, so that will take us up to the root. We then want to do cd etc, and then we want to go into the apt folder. So we do a list, and the sources.list is the file I want to edit. Uh, before we go uh, do that, uh, we'll install something just so you can see. Um, the effect afterwards um, otherwise you won't know it's changed so what I would suggest is download something so do sudo apt hyphen get install let's put unzip on there it's nice and small and uh, only uh, runs when we request it so I'm going to install that type in my password and you can see it's downloaded from U uh, US archive dot Ubuntu.com. Um, I'm in the UK, so obviously um, where that data is coming from is going a longer route. So in theory, it should take longer than uh, a server uh, located in Europe or in the uh, UK itself should be faster than Europe. So that's installed from US.archive. Uh, now what we want to do is edit the sources, uh, just clear that, the sources.list um, so fire up your favourite editor uh, you can use Nano, VI or anything like that, I'm going to use Pico so sources.list, remember to do the sudo at the beginning so you've got administration rights so uh, the first thing to take note of here is what code name uh, Ubuntu you've got um, if you're using another version um, like Camerick or uh, all the others, I can't think of any at the top of my head, uh, then what, about to, what I'm about to paste in you'll have to change. So I'm going to load up my mirrors. So here's the mirrors we need to add. I'm going to copy that. I'm going to go back to my editor, add a new line, paste that in and there's my mirrors so I'm going to do control X I want to save that um, sorry go back to what I said if the code name is different then you need to change this up here okay uh, so if you've got Cameric down here then put that up here and that's the only thing you need to change so I'm going to save that then what we need to do is do an update so sudo apt hyphen get update so that's almost done now Okay, so that's updated. Now we need to test um, if it actually does uh, go to the nearest mirror. So earlier it was going to us.archive.ubuntu. Uh, so I'm going to do um, sudo apt get install zip. So the thing to notice here is it hasn't gone to the US archive, it's gone to archive.ubuntu.com, which I believe is in the UK. Um, I'm not sure if I scroll up. Yep, there you can see earlier it got uh, the other file from us.archive.ubuntu. So it has gone to a different location. Um, just to show you how the mirrors files work, I've actually accessed that mirrors.txt file. And as you can see, 
uh, they're all UK uh, addresses uh, and that's because uh, the server detects where you are ge geo, uh, geo location and serves a different file so if I actually um, connect via my VPN, VPN and see if this actually changes um, the, IP, uh, the domain so if I do a control okay I've just uh, connected to a VPN uh, in Holland in Amsterdam um, as you can see that text file uh, dot mirrors uh, mirrors dot text sorry has uh, detected that I'm in Holland and changed the mirrors so if I then go to do uh, let's go back into our app uh, putty so if I do sudo appy get update update it once again hopefully this time it will be quicker so if I now do sudo apt get install umra and as you can see it's now fetched it from ftp.nl ug.nl because that's in Holland I hope that's helped and I hope it speeds up your uploads uh, download sorry I'll see you soon bye bye